I mean, I, I, I yeah, you know, yeah, I, I think he does. I mean, you know, he knows when he can come out of the pocket and make some, you know, make some plays. Um, and he knows he can come out of the pocket. It's just a matter of one of the things that you have to, uh, what you, you know, what, what, what you're always trying to do too is um, you don't want guys that are just, you know, in the pocket and stand there like, like I said, you know, sticks or statues, uh, never come out of there. On the other hand, I don't, you don't want people that, first guy that flashes, now I'm off, I'm off and running. So you're trying to, you know, especially during spring, we're trying to play through things. So if the defense beats us off the edge or something, you know, and, you know, you teach the, you know, you're teaching the defender to run by so the quarterback can still step up and make a, make a throw to where he wants to go, uh, you know, and that helps, that, that helps obviously us on offense by, you know, we're following, we're following through on a progression and able to make a completion or at least make an attempt at the throw. And it helps the defense in the secondary because now they can still cover the routes and things like that as opposed to always blowing it dead when, you know, somebody penetrates, uh, penetrates the pocket. But, um, yeah, it's, there, there's a fine line. But, yeah, he, you know, he knows when, when he can use it and when, when not to. But he's, he's good at hanging in there knowing that, you know, he, he can make a play with his arm uh, and he trusts his arm. He trusts, he trusts his legs as well, but he's, he's, he's not going to, uh, you know, he's not going to come running, running out of the pocket. It's not the first thing he's thinking about. He's thinking about getting the ball where it's supposed to go.